Welcome dear students, I am Mr. Abhijit. Welcome to my channel Chemistry Learners. In this session we are going to see what are the bio batteries or it is also called as bio electrochemical batteries. Also we are going to see the definition of battery and cell. Along with that we will see in details what are bio electrochemical batteries or bio batteries. First of all we will see what are the batteries or cells. बैटरी और सेल में डिफरेंस क्या होता है एज वी नो बैटरी इट इज ए सेट ऑफ डिफरेंट सेल्स विच आर ज्वाइन इन अ पर्टिकुलर सीरीज बट सेल इट इज ए सिंगल एंटिटी विच प्रोवाइड द इलेक्ट्रिक करंट तो डेफिनेशन भी वैसी होगी एंड इलेक्ट्रिक बैटरी इज अ डिवाइस कंसिस्टिंग ऑफ वन और मोर इलेक्ट्रोकेमिकल सेल्स दैट इज यूर बैटरी मीन्स बैटरी कंटेन्स वन और मोर इलेक्ट्रोकेमिकल सेल्स ओके विच आर एक्सटर्नली कनेक्टेड to provide power to the electrical device such as flashlights smartphones and electric cars but if you see here these two pictures i have shown here that is one is a battery okay which is a set of different cells and the cell it is a single entity so this is the main difference between the battery and cell both are having the same function to provide the electric current to the particular electrical devices now We'll see what are the different types of batteries. Batteries के अलग अलग types होते हैं Depend है कि वो हम charge कर सकते हैं या नहीं कर सकते इस पे ये battery के तीन types है One that is your primary battery that cannot be charged again. उसको हम charge नहीं कर सकते जैसे वो discharge होती है it get vanished. Okay? You cannot recharge it again. That is called as a primary battery. But if you see the secondary battery, इट कैन बी चार्ज एंड डिस्चार्ज अगेन एंड अगेन हम इसे चार्जिंग कर सकते हैं डिस्चार्जिंग कर सकते हैं जैसे कि बैटरी आपकी मोबाइल की बैटरी है ये सेकेंडरी बैटरी या फिर इसमें आप प्राइमरी बैटरी में एग्जाम्पल ले सकते हैं आप अगर जो सेल यूज कर रहे हैं आपके घड़ी के लिए ओके तो वो जो सेल है दैट सेल इज नथिंग बट दी प्राइमरी टाइप ऑफ सेल और प्राइमरी टाइप ऑफ बैटरी और जो तीसरा टाइप होता है बैटरी का दैट इज रिजर्व बैटरी रिजर्व मतलब दे आर हैविंग स्पेशल अरेन्जमेंट जिसमें टू डिफरेंट पार्टीशन होते हैं उनको हम अलग करके रखते हैं जब हमें उसे यूज करना है तब हम उसे ब्रेक करके उसका जो मेमरेन है उसको ब्रेक करके हम देन यू कैन यूज द पर्टिकुलर इलेक्ट्रिक करंट वेन एवर इट इज नीडेड दैट्स वाई दे आर हैविंग स्पेशल अरेन्जमेंट ठीक है तो जैसे कि मिलिट्री एप्लीकेशन है या फिर स्पेस क्राफ्ट में जो कुछ बैटरीज वगैरह यूज होती है दे आर हैविंग दिस टाइप ऑफ बैटरी दैट इज रिजर्व बैटरी so these are the three different types of batteries now we are going to see bio electrochemical batteries or they are also called as bio batteries to ye jo bio batteries hai jaise hum okay we are human beings or uh, you can consider any animal or plants they are nothing but the bio batteries unme jo function hota hai that is like a bio battery means whatever the food we consume that get converted into the glucose okay and whatever that glucose is there that is releasing or that is generating some of the energy in our body for the survival same for the other animals also or jaise aap plants bhi consider karte ho plants they themselves make their own food and whatever the food is generated with the help of that the glucose is formed and that glucose is utilized for the generation of electricity so the same functioning can be performed by the बायो बैटरीज बायो बैटरीज भी ये सेम फंक्शन परफॉर्म करते हैं वो हम डिटेल में देखेंगे ओके तो बायो बैटरी इट इज ए डिवाइस ऑफ दैट स्टोर द एनर्जी ओके इट इज ए एनर्जी स्टोरिंग डिवाइस दैट इज पावर्ड बाय ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड्स। ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड्स लाइक योर ग्लूकोज ग्लूकोज इसमें इंक्लूड होता है जो एनर्जी सप्लाई करने के लिए या फिर एनर्जी जनरेट करने के लिए यूज होता है these bio batteries generate the electricity from the renewable fuels like your glucose sucrose or fructose etc okay so uh, they actually provide the uh, energy as as the demand is there okay jaise aapko energy ka supply chahiye waise waise wo energy kya karte hain generate karte hain aur energy provide karte hain okay so these are nothing but the bio batteries so what is the actually 
reaction which is taking place into the bio batteries suppose enzymes are there enzymes these are nothing but the bio catalyst biological catalyst jo kya karte hain hum jo food consume karte hain suppose use break down karte hain okay degradation of food takes place and that converts it into the glucose use glucose mein convert karte hain and then this glucose releases some of the protons and electrons along with this energy तो ये जो प्रोटॉन और इलेक्ट्रॉन की मूवमेंट होती है या फिर जनरेशन होता है दैट रिलीज ऑफ प्रोटॉन्स एंड इलेक्ट्रॉन्स गिव्स यू सम ऑफ द एनर्जी एंड दैट इज नथिंग बट दी बायो एनर्जी एंड वट एवर दी इलेक्ट्रिक करंट और इलेक्ट्रिसिटी यू कैन से और या फिर एनर्जी यू कैन से दैट इज ऑप्टेंड दैट इज नथिंग बट दी बायो एनर्जी ये आपकी हो गई बायो एनर्जी ओके नाउ इफ यू सी Why bio batteries? Why we need bio batteries? Because it may lead to an uh, alternative solution for oil and other energy sources. जैसे कि आपके conventional energy sources या फिर fuels हैं, उनके लिए भी आप alternative source या फिर solution you can say that these bio batteries provide. Then it is not only friendly to the environment, but also it has great potential for the use of an energy source. then it does not contribute to the increase in carbon dioxide because whatever the carbon dioxide is generated that can be recycled again it can be renewable and a continuous source of energy because whatever the cycle is there oxygen then that oxygen is converted to carbon dioxide again that carbon dioxide is utilized to convert the convert it into the oxygen that is the cycle means it is a renewable source then it can eliminate the drawbacks of the traditional batteries made up from the metal plates heavy metal sum use karte hain ya fir uh, batteries mein jo kuch strong acids vagera jo hum use karte hain ye iska jo use hai wo hum eliminate kar sakte hain with the help of the use of these bio batteries then they are not dependent on the weather jaise ki you can say the natural source of energy jaise ki wind tidal energy all these sources they are depend on the weather also you can say that solar energy they are depend on the weather but if you see the biological activities or bio energy or bio batteries they are independent of the weather whatever may be the weather they show their performance now how bio battery works bio battery ki working kya hai ab ye hum dekhenge jaise ki hame pata hai ke bio batteries they are directly receiving the energy from glucose okay so the glucose that is obtained by the consumption of food these batteries then store this energy for later use baad mein agar hame use karna hai to bhi ye energy store karke rakh sakte hain the concept is same as how plants and animals obtain the energy plants ya fir animals mein jo kuch energy aapko दिखाई देती है या फिर जो कुछ एनर्जी जनरेट होती है दैट एनर्जी इज जनरेटेड विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस ग्लूकोज देन दी बायो बैटरी यूज बायो कैटेलिस्ट जैसे मैंने आपको एंजाइम कहा था दैट आर दी बायो कैटेलिस्ट आइदर बायो मॉलिक्यूल्स लाइक सम ऑफ द एंजाइम्स और इवन होल लिविंग ऑर्गेनिज्म बायो बैटरी ऑपरेटेड बाय ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड मोस्टली बाय दी ग्लूकोज एग्जाम्पल यहाँ पे लिया है मैंने देखो ये जो फर्स्ट एग्जांपल यहाँ पे आप ये एग्जांपल देख रहे हैं दिस इज नथिंग बट दी शिवनिला ऑनिडेंसिस इज ए मराइन बैक्टीरिया दैट इट कैन डेवलप इलेक्ट्रिक करंट व्हेन दिस स्पेसीज दिस बैक्टीरिया इज इन कांटेक्ट विद द मेटल इट प्रोड्यूसेस और इट डेवलप इलेक्ट्रिक करंट सो बाय द यूज ऑफ सच टाइप ऑफ बैक्टेरिया यू कैन जनरेट दी एनर्जी मीन्स इलेक्ट्रिक करंट so that is nothing but the part of the bio battery also if you see the e coli bacteria so this is the e coli bacteria they are used to generate energy from the glucose so these are the two prominent examples which are to be used in the bio batteries as an example of bacteria now we'll see what is the working of bio battery how they work okay suppose glucose glucose and in presence of oxygen with the help of some of the enzymes it converts it into the carbon dioxide and water molecule along with this the enzymes produces the 
electrical energy and that electrical energy is nothing but the bio battery so this is actually the working of the bio batteries glucose whatever the food we consume or the glucose molecules that in presence of oxygen and in presence of enzymes so this is nothing but the setup of the bio battery okay the by product of this is carbon dioxide and water molecule that is again a eco friendly uh, by product this carbon dioxide again can be reutilized or recycled with the help of the plants and this enzymes on this reaction produces this electrical energy also this can be shown by a setup like your this diagram okay if you consider here these are the two electrodes one is a anode and other is cathode which is having some of the electrolyte material so they are connected with the electric source also if you see here this is the glucose molecule here there is generation of protons and with the help of this oxygen the water molecule is released as again here by product along with the carbon dioxide so in this way the generation of protons and electrons and the movement of the electrons gives you some of the energy and that energy is nothing but the bio energy and that is the function of this bio battery now we'll see what are the application of these bio batteries first it is portable and it is used in portable charging like your cell phones walkmans then in disaster relief generators remote power in medical implants also like in pacemakers insulin pumps these bio batteries are used and in replacing the batteries like your toys ya fir electric uh, greeting cards hote hai usme bhi hum ye small batteries bio batteries use kar sakte hain so these are nothing but the applications of these bio batteries so with this uh, we stop here for such important and informative videos please subscribe to my channel chemistry learners and don't forget to press bell icon button thank you